where are we now again? Have to back all the way down this lane again, look. What a driver, huh? Schumacher. Lewis Hamilton, for all my uh, British fans and subscribers. Yeah, just here on the corner now, up over this wall, look. Show you guys again. Show you guys again. It's all rough and ready. Look at the look at the condition of that. Look at all that buying weed in morning glory. It's coming up onto this garden here, so the client gets me in to sort it out. So we'll sort this out. All under control. No, I had to reach over this fence. Um, and just trim, trim back to morning glory, the bind weed, trimmed all the ivy in, trimmed the top of the hedge down, boom, and tidied up the garden. This is a quickie now guys, and we all love a quickie. This is a quickie in the morning, in and out. So yeah, time for takeoff, over and out. A few hours later, subscribe. Just there now privet hedge cut on a tight squeeze here up the side of a property looking forward now to breaking free into the garden let's get all the awkward corners out of the way first so we can get up onto the grassy part then and where the lawn is and, and drive on you know so there you go now i have the side done up the side of the shed i, I reached in there with the hla because i'm too fat to get in now let's go on a diet <laughs> um <laughs> I know if this part of the hedge left now, I'm up on the grass. Yay! Celebrations, let's do cartwheels. The hedge has gone out of control. That is my own fault to get a pack under control. Genie, yeah. So, I'll sharpen this bad boy up now. And uh, we'll crack on. I have the tarps up. It's going to get a lot easier now, lads, because I have, and ladies, my apologies, uh, the compost bin is right there in the corner, so drag them along into the compost bin, and then I can whip out the moor in a minute. Just clip the side off that hedge as well. I'll whip out the moor there now in a minute, and uh, cut the grass as well, you know. You're probably, as I always say, you're probably used to this garden now at this stage, but it's up to me now to keep this place nice and sharp, Mr. Tidy style. They call oh, me no. Mr. Tidy, because this is how I roll. No. The tight squeeze is sorted. I trim back the pit of sporum. I'm over breath here now because I just have to draw on all my machinery. Down to the van. Beds are weeded. I weed them every week. And then the hedges are done, guys. Lawns as well. Now you're probably going to ask me, Damien, why do you put sheets down on the grass when you're collecting the hedging? Why don't you just pick it up at the moor? Reason being, guys, Lads and ladies, I fertilise this lawn and I like to look after this lawn because this is one now that's very well kept on Damien's portfolio, on the Mr Tidy portfolio. And uh, I just think it's the right thing to do. There's too much hedge in there. Get it off the grass as fast as you can. Get it onto the sheets, especially, especially when you've a compost bin around. But it's just pure laziness. And it's doing it the right way. We do things here now the right way. The next day. Oh, bit of a misty one now today. The last few bits oh, to bring in. Yeah. Right, this one. Probably recognise this one now if you're a fly in the wall to my channel. There's a gate. The hedge has been cut down in the corner. There's a pillar after being removed. There's an electric gate going in. You can see all the wiring. So Mr. Tidy now is here. Oh yeah, and I remember I was telling you the garden was coming out and there was a concrete path going in. So there you go, you know, looks well. Just have to move that gate away from the fence there and I just put one over there already. Magnolia tree, just have to sort that out. Grislinia hedge here. A couple of few little jobs to do here now today. Nothing too heavy. It's a bit misty. S spring or autumn mist. Spring, where am I going with spring? Um, yeah, so I'm just going to start out the top of that, or that, that uh, privet hedge. It's first thing in the morning here now, guys, so I'm a bit foggy. Hence the day is a bit foggy as well. So look, I'm just going to get cracking on. Keep out all the cream crackers while I'm working. So, keep them out. Especially when you have tools loose. So let's crack on. Keys. I always keep my keys near my water. There you go.
Battling the way through, had this section covered now. Just going to move the tarps, move the tarps. That's not my bag, by the way. I don't know what's going on. It's the builders are probably leaving stuff everywhere. That side of the hedge is cut now. You just have to cut the this side and the top. So I'll just move the tarps, kick on, and guys, I'll show you the finish. All right, right, top of the hedge, nice and flat, as I said to you guys before. Keep the tops of the hedge flat. It looks as well over there. Don't mind this all curvy crap that people be trying to do or triangles and all that. Top of the hedge, nice and flat. Cap it down. Clients of it. There's a bit in the corner below that I couldn't reach with the shed in the way. I'll get that from the other side now because I have to hop in here next. <sighs> it's all that, you know. So I'll just do a bit of a clean up here. Let the machine cool down. Let me cool down a little bit. And um, clean up and kick on. That's basically it. Yeah. All go, isn't it? All go. Magnolia tree sorted as well there. Bit of, bit of crap to sort out there. No, I'll just open that fence again. Keep an eye on my gear then. Make sure no cream crackers come in the gate. Because if they come in the gate to Mr. Tidy, they're coming in on top of the wrong boy, lads. The wrong boy. Trust me on that. The wrong boy. I welcome all comers. Right. Off we go. Just up in the roof of a shed, behind this shed, there's an old ash tree coming up. And it's actually blocking a window down here, so I'm just going to hop down there, do a bit of chopping, and uh, yeah, that's basically it. Just take that out, over and out. You're going to say, no, what am I doing filming here? <laughs> but I'm actually stuck down inside here now, look. Lovely, 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 lovely. No problem sorted. Kinda, you can see out the window again. Just one of those quick jobs now guys, you know. Bit of a favour for the client. See the hedges all cut. Um throw this all saw down there now. That saw is with me 15 years. It has taken the most abuse and cut down the most amount of crap. 15 years, it's never been lost. You know why? Because it's blue and it stands out in the grass. If it was green, be gone. There you go. There you go. Great fun, isn't it? Talking away to myself up here on the roof. Up on a roof. I'm lying down on the top of a roof. Oh. That's it. Good to go. Good to go. No, it's just getting down, lads. I'll talk to you on the ground. Now quickly before I go, that's the finish. I just put that skip bag back in the corner, hedge is cut down, cut down here, magnolia tree tidied up, went up over that roof, sorted out that ash tree, just pull out the snake gate there now. And um that's basically I just tie up the wire now and we'll move on. I'm in next door next. So thanks for watching our video. Again, look at the hole in that hedge, they're putting a pillar up there again I'd say I reckon. Something's gonna to have to happen here, over and out.